The organized labor and some economists has faulted the plan by the federal government to transfer 8,000 into the account of 12 million vulnerable and poor Nigerians over the next six months to caution the effects of the removal of subsidy on premium motor spirits, popularly known as petrol. The Senate had on Thursday approved the request of President Bola Tinubu to borrow $800 million from the World Bank. It also amended the 2022 Supplementary Appropriation Act to accommodate the provision for $500 billion for palliatives to mitigate the effect of petrol subsidy removal on Nigerians. The president requested for two approvals and separate letters read by the Senate president, Godsby Akwabiu, at the plenary. According to Tunumbu, the $800 million loan will be used to cater for the welfare of the vulnerable and poor households in the country under the National Safety Net Program. While the sum of 8000 will be transferred monthly to the bank account of 12 million poor and low-income households for six months. <laughs>